Hello everyone, this is Harry from Iris Communication. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can reset your TP-Link TLWA901ND access point. This is 300 Mbps wireless end access point. For example, you already set up this one. And if you not set up this one already, check my video. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can change your setting inside. That means you can change one Wi-Fi to another Wi-Fi that means you already set up one Wi-Fi now you want to change that to another Wi-Fi so how you can do that first you need to connect this one with your desktop PC and with the power connector I will do that and I will be back okay here we are again and I'm at Windows 8 process at the Windows 8 and Windows 7 will be the same at the desktop of Windows 8 and it is almost the same as Windows 7 here as you see for this we will not need any internet connection. Access point is connected with the PC. You have to see this icon of the internet connection. You have to click right button on this and open and you have to click at open network and sharing center. Click on that. After that at the corner as you see change adapter setting click on this. As you see the Ethernal, you have to see this one because the repeater or access point should connect it at Ethernal port. That means the Ethernal port of your desktop PC or laptop, whatever. Click right button on this. Click properties. In the properties, you have to find that internet protocol version 4 TPC slash IP4 V. Click on this and click properties. Here the second option you have to click use following IP address here put 190 sorry here put 192.168.1.2 click here subnet mark don't do nothing here default gateway will be 192.168.1 and finally 254 hit ok close this one refresh this page and to be sure that you are properly connected with your PC or not we have to go to DOS menu in Windows 7 you just need to click start button after that as accessories you will see CMD that command pump in Windows 8 at search button you can click CMD and it should come here as you see here CMD my click command pump you have to click here CD dot dot again CD dot dot now we are at C drive as you see and we have to type one command that is PING 192.168 point one point two five four hit enter if you see request timeout that means it's not connected properly you can do one thing you have to go again to the settings click right button open network and sharing center change adapter setting click right button on this properties Internet protocol version 4 click properties here We put Last time I put 2 Now click here and put 192.168 1 point make this 2 as 1 Hit ok close this one Refresh close close this one too now put here in command pom PING 192.168.1.254 hit enter as you see replying from 192.168.1.254 bytes 32 times 1 millisecond TTL 64 that means it's working properly receive for loss 0 is fine if you see this now you can do setup 
and change your configuration okay close this one better use internet explorer or firefox google chrome is not working properly with this at address bar of internet explorer type 192.168.1.1 254 hit enter they will ask you your username and password you already put username and password in my case that is admin admin that is the default username and password the password is 2 admin hit enter you will inside this menu and as you see everything is working properly received now hit at network for example the last time it was 192.168.1.1 is the IP of my that router this time I put 0 at the middle this means this is new IP of another router I have to put here and I have to hit save is give error message click at back just leave as this 192.168.1.1 hit save okay without restarting it will be not successful so you have to restart okay now you see zero zero that means now we change the gateway as you see receive and send signal is zero that means you have to do all configuration once again this is done here click the next option wireless here as you see put universal repeater don't do nothing put your country here and is already is connected to this MAC address I want to change this one to another Wi-Fi hit survey last time it was connected with the fiber till now I want to connect to DDWRT this Wi-Fi so I have to click connect here if the option is hidden make the page big so you can see the option connect just hit the connect option of this Wi-Fi and hit save change of wireless configuration will not take effect until the AP access point reboot please hit click here to reboot it's restarting okay it's bring me to this menu again and still no receive and send signal all is zero now hit wireless one more time is fine now you have new mac mac address that is fine all is fine don't do nothing here hit the second option at the wireless wireless security and you have to put password of the wireless you want to repeat in that Wi-Fi if you have WPA Wi-Fi part source system or WPA2 Wi-Fi part source system it should appear here you have to click on that you have to put the password here in this case I will change the password because I changed the Wi-Fi put new password 014-9351-426 I will hit save and reboot the system okay here we are now you see here we have received and sent information 919 bytes is received packet 7 and send 9, 97,985 and package 175 when you see receive that means your repeater or access point is working properly now what I have to do you have to close this one close all and here at the corner hit the right button on this icon of the networking open network and share center hit change adapter setting hit eternal click at the properties find that internet protocol version 4 click properties and click obtain IP address automatically click OK close this one close all refresh your page you should see the internet is working it means you are connected to the internet via your repeater or access point for be sure click any page and I'm connected with the Facebook you see all is fine and good okay
If you like this video, please do subscribe. If you have any question, leave me as a comment. I will try to answer you as much fast as possible. As always, for more information, go to the Iris Communication www.iriscommunication.com. Good night. Ciao.